Hey there everyone, Hitesh here back again with another video. In this video, we are featuring an app, an app made by a student. So let's talk about what's so special about this app and what you can learn from the student who made this app. Last time when I did a featuring app video, I got approached by almost 20 to 30 people who have made the app and thought that this is a channel where I feature a lot of app and their feature and probably I can do that for them if the app is really good. But honestly, all of those apps were really crap and they were basically the companies who were ready to pay me to feature their app and if their app would have been good, I probably could have thought about that. But uh, all of the apps were not so good so I said hey I'm not I'm not able to do a video for you because I don't think so your app will be helpful and useful and what they were offering me was just money which uh, with the God's grace I'm not in such a big need as of right now because what they can pay me is probably just enough for this lens or probably not enough to buy even a more uh, one more lens for these kinds of videos. Coming back onto the topic uh, we are featuring a very awesome app in this video. Now, if you're thinking this app does a whole lot of things like social media and all of that, no, but the story behind this app is gonna motivate you. So stay tuned, let's talk about it. So this is a basic calculator app. Now, I know a lot of you thinking, hey, what's so special about the calculator? And probably there is not so special about the calculator app. It's a bare minimum basic app which when you tops, uh, taps on a button, uh, adds a number or do simple arithmetic operation like addition, multiplication, division and so forth and so on. What else this user has, this creator of this app has done is adding a toast message here and there where the features are missing and has also done one great thing is addition of matrix. Now in case uh, you do remember, uh, you have played quite a lot with the matrix in all of the programming languages like C, C++ or maybe in Java as well where you add or multiply these matrices. Do you remember them? 3x3 three three matrix and 4x4 four four matrices and all such awesome things. Now what's so interesting about this app, although the functionality is almost okay-ish, I will not call it a basic childish, it's okay-ish, a little bit complicated. Complications are there, uh, for example, moving on intents and all these things. But what I want to say here is, is this guy is motivational. Because here you can see that a lot of us and probably you as well have written probably various number of times these kinds of matrix code in the C programming language. But what this student has done here is he said, no, I'm not going to keep all of that code in my file in my laptop. I will take that code and will show to the users that what I can do. I will take this code and will make an app from it and will reach out to the users so that at least somebody can use it or if nobody can use it, I can check my Android app on my phone. Now, these kinds of students are stubborn. They cannot take no and probably they are the best kind of student because they cannot take no. They are always gonna say, no matter what time does it take, no matter what effort does it take, I'm gonna finish this up and I'm gonna reach to the end of this project and so is done by this student. Now, some of you might be thinking that, hey, you might have taught this in your course. And no, I don't teach a calculator app in my course. In my course, I teach about the things like how you can lay out an awesome layout thing so that they stay intact. I teach about how the button works, how the toast messages are, are being played, how you can move on from one screen to another screen, how you can pass data from one screen to another screen. No calculator app at all. And probably no course or no book in the world can can teach you to make exactly same app what you are looking up for. So what you have to do is learn those basic bare minimum core concept of the topic and have to apply it on your own. Probably and I'm pretty sure you will be facing tons of problems with that and that's okay. But what makes you a better programmer is the thing that you are not gonna take no. You're gonna say that hey I'm gonna reach to the end of this goal and I'll make sure my app reaches to the app store. Now, did it cost something to this student? Yes, of course it cost because when you, when you put your app onto the Android store, it does charge you $30 at the beginning. So yes, he did made an investment, but is this investment worth it? Yes, definitely. 
Now, a lot of you might be wondering what is useful of these kinds of app uh, if I put this on the app store. These apps are really helpful because a lot of us are looking up for the jobs, maybe freelancing or getting hired by a company. Now, few students, what they try to do is look out for the agencies and training institute which just say, we provide assistance in getting hired. Now, what they usually do is they teach you how to make good resumes and probably will recommend you to some companies. But what this student is going to do, this is something amazing. He is just going to write when the companies will say that, hey, do you know Android? Instead of providing a certificate and relying basely and coldly on certificate, he will say, yes, I know it. And here's the link of my app that is on the App Store. So I know how to, do, how to design an app as well as I know the struggles to make sure that your app reaches to the Google Play Store. So if I'm guided by your senior developers, I can assist in your company in making an awesome product on which you are already working. And we all know everybody needs these kinds of people who are really project oriented, who know their stuff instead of relying on just a bare minimum certificate. Yes, definitely you can get hired uh, based on the certificates as well. But end of the day, it's the project. It's the code that you will be writing. It's the work that is on the topmost shelf in every company. So this student did send me a mail early in the morning and said, hey, I'm really inspired by your videos and your videos really helped me to stuck on one app and make sure that it reaches to the Google Play Store. It would be really helpful if you can feature this app on your channel. Again, there is no money involved in this case. This is an inspiration that I wanted to share with you. If you have made such kind of awesome app and you have been learning something from this channel or maybe from Learn Code Online, make sure your product reaches to me. I, I check out all of those products. And again, I cannot feature all of the products uh, on my channel. Otherwise, it will become just a product featuring channel. But I try my best. If there is an inspirational story behind some of the project, if there is something that's worth sharing, I definitely like to share that on my channel without any charge. Now, I know you are also having an awesome app idea and you want to build that up, but you are probably looking up I'll start it maybe tomorrow or I'll start it maybe from Monday or maybe I'll think about it after finishing up my Games of Thrones episode. Now there is nothing wrong in watching that series but why are you just keep thinking about it? Why don't you just say I will do it today? So take out your laptop, install Android Studio or maybe a text editor if you want to make a website make sure you start it right now. If you want to make an app make sure you start it right now. Let me know in the comment section below if you have something in mind that you are looking up to create in the future or if you are interested in learning Android or web application and why, you do, why do you really want to learn it. I'll be looking up in the comment section and if you think that this video was awesome, give it a thumbs up and I'll come up with more awesome videos at this channel. I'll surely catch you up in the next video.